Knowing the amount of water within a media, referred to as water holding capacity, or WHC, of your growing media, can help you manage irrigation scheduling more effectively and ensure plants have adequate moisture. Testing for water holding capacity is not difficult and can be done with minimal cost and some basic equipment and a little bit of time. The following video shows a process for carrying out a practical on-site water holding capacity test on growing media. Growing media testing um, can provide us with a, with a means of uh, detecting problems uh, that would have an adverse effect on, on our plants. The equipment required for a water holding capacity test is a moistened growing media sample. The sample used during an air fill porosity test is ideal. A set of scales, a drying tray and record sheets. Weigh the empty tray and record the weight. Put the sample of wet media in the tray and weigh. Record the weight of the tray and the wet media. The media then has to be dried until no free moisture is left in the media. An ideal way of doing this is by drying in an oven overnight at 50 degrees Celsius. Read the weight and calculate the water holding capacity. The water holding capacity result achieved for this pine bark and coir fibre growing media of 42% is within the recommended range of greater than 40% for 140 to 200 millimetre trees and shrubs. Things are always evolving so the more we learn on the mixes that we're currently using and compare them against new trial mixes, um, we can always improve that by doing these tests. More information on growing media properties and testing can be found in Container Media Management. This short training video has been supported by South East Queensland Irrigation Futures Rural Water Use Efficiency Initiative. Special thanks go to Heaton's Nursery and Tropical Exotics.